Causes of Hair Loss Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Howe, and today I'd like to explain the causes of hair loss. There are various reasons, but hair loss is generally accelerated by some specific factors. The main culprits are excessive stress, negative lifestyle habits, and genetics. First, let's take a look at excessive stress. Stress is the biggest contributing factor of hair loss acceleration. By living in a dynamic, fast-paced society, we are saddled by stress in various ways. Stress grows from uncertain thoughts about the future, worrying about potential job prospects, personal relationships, traffic, pregnancy, infant care, retirement, and so on. We relieve the stress with various methods. One of them is getting a good night's sleep. Proper sleep habits promote better functioning of the parasympathetic nerve system, providing the needed balance inside our bodies. Humans become stricken with an imbalanced auto-nerve system when we are under continual, excessive stress. This causes hair loss. Secondly, lifestyle habits can cause hair loss. There are several bad behaviors that can speed up this process. Let's take a look at Demodex folliculorum, which are little bugs that live in our follicles. Demodex parasites can cause inflammation and damage our follicular cells. When this becomes chronic, the follicles break and become more difficult to repair. All of us have a small number of Demodex in our follicles. But if you think you may have an excessive number of Demodex, please consult your healthcare professional. Now, let's take a look at another human behavior. If shampoo or conditioner does not wash out completely when we clean our hair, the leftover surfactants, or surface active agents, that remain can cause hair loss. The hair can be influenced by heat from a blow dryer, substances from creating a permanent wave, or coloring chemicals. The most important preventive step is thoroughly cleaning the hair and follicles. Excessive drinking and smoking can cause degeneration of the capillaries and advance hair loss. If the capillary is degenerated, it moves away from the surface of the hair. If so, it becomes difficult to supply the proper nutrition and oxygen to the follicles. Third, let's take a look at genetic causes. To understand the genetic cause of hair loss, you need to understand DHT. DHT is dihydrotestosterone, which is the substance that comes from bonding testosterone with 5-alpha reductase. DHT impedes the blood supply to the follicles and attacks them. The hair becomes thinner and hair loss is accelerated. The amount of DHT present in the system is genetically determined. Hair loss is not only influenced by the amount of DHT, but also by stress levels, lifestyle, degeneration, hormones, and so on. So it's hard to say whether hair loss can be 100% attributed to genetic factors. In this video, we've investigated the causes of hair loss. If you'd like to know about existing methods for improving hair loss, please watch the next video, Existing Hair Loss Treatments. Thank you.